Hey, this is Tim with Game Time. Uh, I got another board game unboxing here. This is for uh, Thunderstone Quest. It is one of the newest expansions um, called Raging Seas, quest number 14. I've done all the other quests on my channel. Just, just watch them in there. Um, this is one of the two new ones. Um, it says it plays one, to, uh, two to six rather. Uh, here's what the back shows. And let's see what is inside. Um, this is gonna be mostly cards. Um, and so this Thunderstone Quest is kind of like a dungeon crawl, but it's it's fairly short and, and, and very fun. And you can mix and match all the quests with each other. Uh, but here's the manual, here's the back. Um, just kind of quickly show you what's inside. Here, this book. Let's see a little better if I go down. Here, let's go back. You can see that. This is the missions that you can do, but anyways, looks like it's about 24 pages. Okay, there's that. Uh, here is the, oh gosh, I can't remember what these are called, um, but it gives your guys a special, uh, kind of like abilities during the game. Uh, it comes with the barricades mode right there. Um, that's the barricades mode's version. This is the normal version of them, but it's basically like upgrade path that you can do when you get um, experience right here. Uh, here is the new, uh, looks like this is the big bad. If you're playing uh, Barricades Mode, I don't think you use it for anything else. I have not actually played Barricades Mode. Uh, this is the new, um, um, I guess you can go on voyages in this one. I, I don't know a whole lot about it, but I, knew, I know it has a new mechanic that is a bit different than the other ones. And this is really cool. Um, so these are, uh, normally this is like the dungeon you can go in. Um, but these are, uh, it's like you're going in the ocean instead of in a dungeon. So that's pretty neat. Castaway Island. And then these are the, oops, these are the threes. And all of these go out here like so. And you would just kind of place them out here. And this would be your, your dungeon. Oop. You know, kind of like this. I don't know if you can see all of them. But anyway, those are the new ones for this set. And let's check out all the goodies here. Okay. Uh, so we have some, looks like some, uh, why is this not coming out? Okay, well, it, uh, if you buy these, they come with these nice um, placeholders for the cards. It tells you all the cards that go in their, in their little sets. So these are uh, those. Um, very nice, typically. I'll just kind of go through them fast. So now you guys want to see the cards. Um, so there's that. These are just the normal card stock versions of those. Um, and then let's see what is inside of here. Um, sorry, I'm trying to be a little careful here. I'm trying not to mess up these cards. Um, yeah, I guess not a lot of people know about this game, but it, it is a lot of fun. It's one of my favorites, to be honest. I don't know if it's top 10, but it's definitely top 20. Okay, here are some of the equipment. Cut less. Happy. I think that's how you say that. EP. <laughs> nice thing. Okay. Okay. And there's always comes with extra copies of these things so that you can get more than one and put it in your deck. So this is a deck building game if you're not familiar with it, where you're going to be trying to make a better deck and you put all these different types of heroes into your decks. And it kind of uses the, the basic four. I think it's uh, uh, Cleric. Um, let's see, Cleric, Rogue, uh, I don't know if it calls it Healer, and like a Warrior type guy, and I'll show you in just a second, you'll see them all right inside of here. Uh, these are my Heroes Fighter, that's the, the tough guy, this is the lowest level of him, the one. Okay, and then you can put multiple copies of the same guy, this is level two of the same guy, and it tells you his stuff. And then here's our fighter, and he's also a wizard, so wizard is another one. Wizard's kind of your, your glass cannon, so this is what they do. Okay. And then here's our rogue, and he's a fighter. Looks like everyone's a fighter in this set. And so just having that keyword lets you do special things. Um, Stowaway Stagger, here's an ally. Right here, you can get these guys, add them to your deck. Here's some rum, <laughs> hidden stash. Uh, ship in a bottle, spyglass, swab the deck, the black spot, and then here's a spell, as well as a cutlass, which I think we already saw some of the cutlass. Um, was that only four guys? 
Is that all? Yeah, we're missing one guy. Should be one more, one more guy in this set. I guess he's probably in this deck. Okay. Okay, and these are gonna be the guys you're gonna fight. Which looks like brigands or something. Um, well, here, let me show you the other guy real quick. So, uh, Gurglion, uh, he's just a wizard. Um, and here's his level two card. Okay, and then here's his level uh, three. Hold on, three. And then each of them has a four as well. Did I skip that? I might have skipped that, huh? Okay, uh, Josephine Morgan. Uh, she's just a human cleric. I don't know. Hmm, that's weird. Okay, she's a cleric. And there's her four. Did I skip that for the other two guys? I don't remember seeing. Oh, yeah, there's a four right here. Okay, here's the three in case I didn't show that. I'm so sorry about that. Um, here's the four for this guy, the three. And then for this last guy here is the four as well as the three in case I didn't show uh, one or the other. Okay. Yeah, they have level fours in this set. Um, and the guys you're going to be fighting against... All right, these guys, and usually there's two sets of enemies. This is looks like brigands. Two types, typically, of each type of enemy. Humanoids. So these are the ones, and then this is a different set of ones that you can fight against. They're called, looks like House of uh, Clubba. Uh-oh, and there's several of these, three of them, it looks like. Okay, and here's a different one, Murderous Mermaids. This is the guys that you can fight against. These are level twos. Murderous mermaids. And then Queen's Crew, that's another one. Cook, the gunner, quartermaster. Oh yeah, there's three of this guy, four of this guy. Okay, ghost ship. This is level three enemies, so you would fight them at the three location. And are these different? Yeah, they are. They have different abilities on them at the bottom. If you were to look, I'll just go a little slow. Well, they're all kind of the same look. Okay, Alien Leviathan. That's uh, crazy and cool. This looks like it is uh, from uh, Cthulhu. Sort of. Something. Okay, I'm not sure what these brigands are. Oh, is this? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what these are for. Looks like they have a different symbol right here. But anyway, I'll go through them. And then we have... Oh, a halfling. I didn't see this one. Sticky fingers. Ones. Here's the twos. Here's the threes. And here's the four. So, wow, there's like six different guys that you can play with in this. Um, the final two things are going to be, looks like some more items here. Um, if you're going to play the epic mode, it has one card of each type. So you can stick it in a, a different deck and just makes it easier for playing that special mode. Uh, looks like these are gonna be the voyages. So this is gonna be the new part of this campaign, as well as it looks like it's got some new allies here in Albatross, um, Magic Compass. Oh, I think these are treasures. That's why they got the gold on the bottom. Hungry Croc. Okay, and these are the different perks. So if you do a mission, you can get some of these guys. And these are, oh, these are randomizers, okay. Hmm. Okay, it's going to be one of each. These are new missions that you can do. You get one of these at the beginning of the game. Here is the enemy, the captain right here. Don't know why there's so many copies of her. Here's a, looks like a lower version of her, different version. Shuffle, voyage, and then these are the voyages. So I guess you can, you can go on voyages. Not quite sure how that work because that is something that is indeed new but yeah that is all of these and like i said there's just gonna be one copy of everything else in here so you get you get quite a bit in each of these boxes a lot a lot of cards um you know if you look on the back it kind of shows you um you know 391 and then you get all these other ones as well. Um, it looks like mostly boards. It looks like just 391 cards, but some other stuff that's you know card adjacent. 
uh, you know, boards and whatnot. But yeah, that's uh, this is Thunderstone Quest, um, Raging Seas Quest number 14. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.